That'll work. Lurks on the Icarus platform, a feat of modern science and technology. This city in the clouds was built in 1950. Leading scientists from all the other Soviet republics live here, including the German SSR. You need to have an exceptionally brilliant and dedicated mind to work here. This is very, uh, Bioshocky, <clears throat> which I think was always the idea. Would you care for some more soda, comrade? Can I take it? Sure, thanks. Looks like another bot got stuck in a tree. <laughs> that always cracks me up. Come here, still working on the robot's navigation system. Yeah, I noticed. Wow, what a beautiful day. I really like those, uh, like impeller blade designs, don't they? With your Volvas box entree. You're going haywire. What the hell did you do to them? Is that a pig? Why is there a pig? They've been lying there all day. Number three is bought. I need these houses painted, but look at what they're doing instead. Give me your control code. I'll set them straight. Hold piggy, sweetie. Oh, thanks, Mum. Uh, the code's 0451. I'll remember okay, that. Okay, then. Get to work, you bums. Move it! Move it! Am I driving? Oh, it's a, I'm. Thanks a million. Enjoy the celebration. I didn't know this was me churning along. What the hell is that? No. Plants. Good morning, my boy. How are you? Did you sleep well? Good morning, Doctor Sechenov. I slept fine. Awaiting orders. How do you like the new glove? Better than the old one. It's growing on me. I'd expect nothing less. I designed the device myself. Be careful with it now. It's more important than you might think. Yes, Dr. Sechenov. I'll keep it safe. Report to the lab to complete your integration with the glove. I've got a full schedule today, so Mikhail Stockhausen will get you up to speed. I'll be in touch Mikhail. With Roger that. I thought that was spelled not like Michael. But what do I know, you know? I'm not Russian. Yeah, okay, so to the laboratory, Comrade Major. There's a turbine waiting for you at the airway. Are your orders clear? Crystal, get off my case already. I'm pleased to hear you don't have any questions for once. You dickhead. Not quite as impressive as the Bioshock intros. I mean, I, I feel like they were going for it, but then they're just like, <clears throat> let's just put them on a boat and nothing happens. Comrades! Icarus platform residents and facility guests. Well, let me just go this way first. Look at this juggling ass. Hey, that bot's actually pretty good. Nice coordination. Did you just praise a robot? I'm amazed. That's because it's not constantly trying to give me unsolicited advice. Looks a little unsettled. I used to want to learn. All right, that's cool. Juggling robot. Let's uh, keep on trucking. Do I have? No, I don't have anything. None of my recording things are going except for this stream, which is probably for the best. I probably, uh, it's probably not good to record uh, while recording. What the fuck is that? It's an ostrich bot with with air pumps. What the fuck is this thing? Okay, I should stop playing with things. I'm like sleeping in a park. Nothing weird about that. Can I jump in the water? Look at that. Shiny. It also has that quality 
of Bioshock where like everything works until it goes crazy and tries to kill you and then suddenly these nice looking friendly things are dicks. Ice cream. That is some well crafted ice cream. That looks beautiful. Just, what do you just throw it? A psychopath just throws a stick. What's going on over here? Parade? It's a parade. Not a big parade guy, you know? Learn about the history of Facility 3826. Hear about its great discoveries and pay your respects to all the victims of war. Everyone here seems so happy and content. Just like in China. You've been to China, Comrade Major? I've been everywhere. I mean, everywhere except for China, I guess. Facility 3826 isn't all that I like their spirit. And I hear it's nice there. Indeed it is. Step right up. You can become part of Collective with a thought device, comrades. You'd think they would have Russian accents or something instead of just being like <laughs> like American voice. I don't know. I guess you could play it with a different slow down, voice son, slow voiceover. Down. Oh, look, he's got a mustache. Robot mustache. Some sort of memorial. This is all cool stuff, you but in the war, I, I, Major. Did you just remember? I feel like I would. No, I can't uh, shit. I've been drawing a blank ever since I got injured. It's like there's something stuck in my head, but I, I can't figure out what it is. Crispy critters, man. Fuck. Watch your language, Major. We're in a public place. Yeah, whatever. Someone Comrades, added me to their the friends list. I don't know who that is. The planets of the solar system we will reach the most distant oh, that's and cute. Right now, we are taking our first step. Little hologram. Major Nachai reporting for duty on Comrade Sechenov's direct order. Welcome, Comrade Major. Today is a joyful occasion. The birthday of Collective! Yeah, yeah, many happy returns. Cut to the chase, would you? I've got places to be. Naturally. This is the future of Soviet education. A personal project of Dr. Sechenov's poly education. Gone are the days when Soviet citizens had to spend years studying at educational institutions. From this moment on, just inject a special neuropolymer encoded with the education you want a university-level natural sciences curriculum, for example, and you'll instantly become an educated member of society. Want to learn Korean? Or get a doctorate in nuclear physics? Or learn to play the piano? With Collective 2.0, you can! Yeah, 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 been there, done that. Skip the foreplay, bot. Excuse me, of course! Your particular case definitely calls for something more efficacious. Nevertheless, you will still need an initial neuropolymer injection. <laughs> Comrade Sechenov is expecting you, Agent P3. I've been informed of your imminent arrival. Here, take this capsule. Oh, that one. I'm supposed to... <laughs> Can I eat this? <laughs> Okay, that makes more sense. Could have been a suppository, I guess. I fed my tentacles, now you I'm good to go. You have just upgraded your glove with scanner functionality. Using the neuropolymer as a conduit, the sensors in your glove are now directly connected to your neural system, especially your eyes, polymer retina. To activate the scanner, just make a special gesture. Please choose an object of interest and extend your arm toward it. 
The palm of your hand should be facing the object. Contract all the fingers on your hand, except for your thumb and index finger. Extend your thumb and index finger to form a right angle to activate the scanner. Holy shit, bot. Who designed this thing? The Spanish Inquisition? Oh, see, they could have just shown me this picture. I would have felt better. Left alt. Demon Lamp. be gone. <laughs> For your information, that's a highly user-friendly gesture. It was developed by our leading expert in the field of advanced interpretive avant-garde absurdist Redarder. Dadaism. Whatever that guy's been smoking, sign me up. Didn't you say you were in a hurry just a moment ago? Shut your trap and keep scanning, would you? I'm getting a crazy new mean, hardware. You are I guess if I didn't have to, I, I wouldn't. This ability I, 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 I would. Very useful in <laughs> like, the future. There's an alternative. Now, you can just put it in your arm. Yeah, your go mission. for it. What is that? No. See, it, it runs terrifyingly. You know it's going to be terrifying. Why wouldn't he use the handles? The address by the director. I would have put General my handprints on this on this glass. Doctor Sechenov is about to begin. Oh, now I'm above the parade. That's a cool monster that will probably kill me later. And this is facility 38. What? Well, this technology, they still got these <laughs> ugly ass cars. Neuropolymers have been processed of genetic adaption. It has now become possible to launch a worldwide, all encompassing version You're not of doing the Galactic 2.0 network. Need better last, robots. A network of humans and robots. I'm so glad humans to see you're taking it easy, Comrade Major. The car is waiting. You must Finally, go to Dr. Sechenov's office for the access code. The He's been left with one of his bodyguards. Labor yeah, naturally. Dedicate ourselves to science. On behalf of all... I love this place. No matter how many times I come here, it always amazes me. It's just... so nice. Our elevator has arrived. It will allow human beings to be at the center of Collective 2.0. A network for all mankind together. Unite the Roombas? intellect of all individuals into a powerful mind free of all boundaries. Thanks to the thought neural connector, you will control robots with your mind. I sit down. Mastering academic subjects with I wasn't aware this elevator was going to take this long. All human knowledge and, of course, combining it with your own individual discoveries. You. We'll no longer need control panels, cumbersome communications equipment, and loudspeakers, documents, electronic notebooks, etc. Thought will replace every single one of them. And so much more. Your potential will be unlimited. Want to learn a foreign language in a minute? Master quantum physics in a day. Memorize literary masterpieces from around the world. This all will be possible once your thought neural connector is installed right here on your temple. All communication. Talk about style. Science is power, I tell you. The boss has a way of looking down on insurmountable obstacles. I really respect that. There are no obstacles science cannot surmount. Other than an electronic glove that never oh, shoots us. Here is your vehicle activation code, Comrade Major. Got it. The vehicle is waiting downstairs. You should hurry. You don't have much time. We can take the same elevator we took to get up here. Thanks, Einstein. What would I ever do without you? Can I not explore this room of crashed planes? 
and gigantic robot woman? Because that's interesting. More interesting than riding that elevator again. Okay, I guess not. <laughs> well, that was fun. That was a really worthwhile elevator trip. Section off here. Sorry I can't meet with you in person, my boy. The reporters have been hounding me all day. So, what do you think of Chalamet? You've built yourself a city of the future, boss. There's nothing else like it in the whole USSR. I built it for all mankind, not for Why myself. Why wouldn't they? I mean, that just... Humanity is on the verge of great discoveries. That's a requirement One day these days. we'll reach the stars. These castles in the sky I have a robot will be the beginning of our it. journey to the farthest reaches of the universe. I'm merely helping humanity realize its own greatness. You're a dreamer, Dr. Sechenov. <laughs> Fantasy and science go hand in hand. Most modern inventions were described long ago in science fiction. Reflection. Flying machines, space travel, even robots. Are you telling me you got your ideas from sci-fi novels? I got them from the dreams of mankind, P3. Man was born to dream, to do great things. But unfortunately, there are those who wish to crush those dreams. And that's where men like you come in, Sergei. Men sworn to defend mankind and its destiny. Need me to get rid of somebody, boss? You're very relaxed about it, my boy. I hope it won't come to that. But let's take it one step at a time. First, you'll need a substantial glove upgrade. Report to the lab. A Tereshkova robot will meet you there and take you to the Vavilov complex. Understood? Yes, sir. I'm getting in the car right now. Oh, I get to get inside the shitty cars. I got flying, like, everything. Literal giant platforms that fly. I'm taking a car. A 19, like, 56, like, Volkswagen shitter. But... Do I get to actually drive it? Because I'm probably gonna suck at that. <laughs> oh Jesus! Please is it? I can't tell how big belt. this thing is. We wish you a very pleasant journey. Oh okay, this is normal. Why even have a Isn't car? There supposed to be a radio in here. The entire Soviet Union is ecstatic about the unveiling of collective. This thing just, could just pick me up. Just came from in every get city. It. The American government is expressing deepening concern about the skyrocketing unemployment figures. Like the car the portion of this abroad. seems unnecessary. <laughs> just just get, just get this thing to come Shelton grab me and carry me off. Leave the car. The city of How about some music? That's more like it. I'm sure it's going to kill me later. I'm sure all of these things will kill me later. With all of their arms. So now this is really, this is truly Bioshock experience. You're flying. I see you finally begun your assignment, and it's been less than an hour. Sehr gut. Jawohl, mein Führer. What did you just say? I said the signal's on the fritz, but thanks anyway, Herr Stockhausen. Dr. Sechenov... Oh, everything's flying. Okay. So the car... Again, car is pointless. <laughs> Don't you think that may have been a bit too much? Nope. For some reason, your response didn't surprise me at all. Guess I don't have any respect for brown nosers. Tell me, is there anyone you do have respect for? Sure, but respect is earned. Dr. Jesus. Sechenov has mine because he saved my life on the operating table. Everybody else needs to earn it. Anyway, why the hell are we riding a jalopy strapped to a damn robot? Were all the jets taken or something? So, okay, at least Shit. your protagonist is... Riding is an important tradition. It's a way to remember the days Making when sense. Facility 3826 was brand new, as we used to ride these vehicles to our very first scientific complex. Fair enough, but why is it a tradition to have them pulled by bumblebees? And why do we call them bumblebees when they look more like... Flying pigs. Flying pigs? Have you seen flying pigs before? How about flying cows? Yeah, on the condor. One time some genius like you forgot to put up a fence, but those cows only flew in one direction. Straight down. <laughs> 
I have a suggestion, Comrade Major. Why don't you worry about your mission, and I'll do the thinking for both of us? Shut the hell up, Glove. I'm trying to listen. To what? Is there anything here you haven't seen yet? I've never so been I can before. I can look about Zip this it. much. What? It, it's got this How weird come? little. I don't know. Damn it! Like I got a me. neck brace on. Apologies. Like, you'd imagine you'd be able to turn your head more than, like, 14 degrees. Yeah, what, what can you do, you know? <laughs> they don't want to render any more than the stuff that's right in front of you. Oh, checked. I, I didn't see an FOV slider, so... Well, let's, let's, I'm going to take a quick peek, just to see. I guess it would be... Yeah, I guess there's, I don't see anything. Just fly into the clouds. What a view. This is facility 3826's audio guide. We will soon be arriving oh, at our destination. Nice. Estimated time of arrival is 11:47 a.m. This is much more appealing Outside to me than temperature 26 degrees Celsius. Plots there is of a land. slight breeze. You can now observe the Soyuz Granite Bridge spanning Lake Lazur and two of the facility's high-profile test sites, the VDNH and Sahalin. These are connected by magnetic levitation or maglev rail. Volumetric. This technology you know, was pioneered Star by the Telemann pulling off nice volumetric fog. And a personal project well, of Dr. Look like shit, But, you know, it's like 50-50. Are they just spinning around to get good views of things? This is... You can now observe the could have been there like 20 minutes ago, but we're just taking the scenic route. ...and distributing machine parts required by the facility's various complexes. Controlled remotely by a collective 1.0 node, a plant such as this is capable of autonomously managing and fulfilling up to 100 orders per hour. Cool. This is Amazon's new delivery system. Directly below is Dr. Sechenov's computational center, the main radio processing unit and control nexus for this network node. We are currently flying this really is like solar like, farms. Capable of it's, I've spent the last half an hour just looking at things. DNH, as well as the friendship of People's Park, nearby settlements, and the Maglev train lines. Maglev train stations connect all of Facility 3826, allowing personnel to travel from one complex to another with comfort and ease. I must be getting soaked with all this rain on the windshield, <laughs> and I, I put the top down. The Motherland Monument, it seems in like a poor choice, to mark flying the through the clouds Union's with the top down. victory in World War II, and are now entering the grounds of the Vavilov Complex. The site where Facility 3826's numerous agricultural miracles took root. You are now observing the Soviet Sickle Monument, designed by sculptors Elena Muhina and Alexander Kibalnikov, and autonomously erected in 1951 by the Collective 1.0 Neural Network with the help of robot builders. Note that this effectively makes it the world's first collaborative artistic effort between man and machine. Our brief guided tour is coming to an end. Facility 3826 is always ready to welcome new specialists from anywhere in the Soviet Union. We are confident that you will be thrilled to live and work in this world of revolutionary breakthroughs and fantastic scientific achievements for the glory of the now Communist I'm backwards. Party and the Soviet people. <laughs> it would be. Like, you would 100% if you are in the situation beginning motion sickness because they're just like flipping you around and like swaying your whole situation oh no oh no uh oh you have reached your destination 
Good thing I was in this high quality car. Take my hand, comrade Major. I will escort you to the Vavilov complex. What in the sweaty hell is going on here? Unfortunately, I have no information uh -oh. on the subject. All the robots have Mustache been carrying out their normal operations until they suddenly became hostile. Oh, what the hell are I you slipped. doing, lousy bot? Get your rusty metal asses out of here! That was really very rude of them. The elevator is now operational. Fuck off, bitch. Some of the robots are Our still nice. Is once again continuing normally. A Dropa towing robot will be here shortly to perform magnetic coupling and take us by air to... Son of a bitch, not again. Oh, help me, Comrade Major. I'm falling. What the shit? She's dead. I'm probably dead too. <laughs> Atomic Heart, that's what it's called. The thing they told us. Don't worry, your glove will wake you up. <laughs> the power glove. It's so bad. Corn raid. Palm raid. Oh. I can't see, I think. <laughs> and I don't know. It's it's weird because there's they're speaking with an obvious American accent, except for like two, two or three Russian words. It's kind of weird. I don't get it. But hey, who am I to judge this game that's made in Russia? English speaking characters. Uh, oh, shit, my head's killing me. Uh. Alright, am I gonna I think I'm about to start playing the game. Thirty minutes in. Almost. What am I doing? Oh. Use the hand tentacles to get an axe. Wizard, this is P3. Come in. Sergey, are you all right, my boy? I'm okay, boss. But nothing here is the way it's supposed to be. He's had a bad Whatever's day. going what on, that red thing? clearly started a while ago. Victor it's a chicken. Oh my god, what the hell is happening? <laughs> what the fuck? Am I in water? Oh, okay. <laughs> I, couldn't, I didn't even see that. Like, I just thought it was weird leaves. Get distracted by a goddamn chicken. Give me that chicken. Okay, I don't know where the chicken went. Bring him to me, alive. Copy that, sir. He's dead. Target is Victor Petrov. My mission is to find him and bring him to you. Exactly. Session of out. Yeah, I, well, you know, this is the thing. I, if it wasn't like if the su if I was working with the subtitles and hey, it's big. Um, if I was working with the subtitles and just watching it, it would be okay. But I don't want to play a game and also have to read the subtitles because I don't think I'd be able to do it. What the hell is that chicken fighting me? Get the hell out of here! I hit a chicken. Oh well, I learned that. Sorry, chicken. You, you're not even the one who hit me. It really did do damage. Are these guys gonna fight me? Oh, I tried to dodge for that. Dodge is this. I tried to jump. That's a, that, that's a thing that I've encountered a lot. Like, sometimes you get dodge that's space, and sometimes it's shift. I've been shifting back and forth between games that that do that, and I mess it up all the time. 
Maybe it's like Zelda and you kill the chickens and they'll all, like, swarm you. There's an alarm level I just noticed. Oh shit, what's that? Holy shit! Hey, Glove. Yes, Major. Any details on the target? Victor Petrov is the lead engineer behind Collective 2.0. He was arrested for treason and sentenced to community Jeez. service at the Vavilov complex. Got it. I can deal with that. Where should I start looking? Petrov is currently somewhere in the underground levels of the Vavilov complex. We'll have to find a way inside. Okay, let's going? do it. Do I go down here? Hey, you! I'm coming! You alive in there? That's a robot. It's a poop bot. It's a poop bot. No, it's a robot. Shit! Uh, get away from me! <laughs> what? Why does this robot want everyone in, the, in this uh, outhouse? John Connor. <laughs> Saved by an old lady. What Love are you it. gawking at? Almost choked to death there. Give me a hand. Oh, I didn't see that coming. You should be more careful. This place is a damn madhouse. Yeah, I noticed. Uh -huh. Thanks for the help, no ma'am. No sweat, Sonny. What are you doing here, anyway? Oh, just passing through. Who are you? Me? A little more than that, I think. Zena. I got Granny dropped Zena. out of the sky. That's all you need to know. Fine, I get it. So what's going on here? Lots of casualties. I don't know if you noticed, but the robots are attacking people. Anyone who couldn't find a place to hide is dead meat. I could really use a weapon. You got anything? I just had an axe like three seconds ago. What happened to it? Of course. But I'm not giving you shit. Beneath us is a complex. If you need a weapon, go down there. The Vavilov complex? That's where I'm headed. Ah. Well, today's your lucky day. I'm heading that way too. It's basically safe. Granny is OP. She's got shit. Oh, no, no. It's a chilla. Son of a bitch. We've got 30 seconds. Move your ass. 30 seconds until what? Ah, 30 seconds until we're fucked, sonny boy. Royally fucked. No good. Get over here, beefcake. Now, no, 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 now. Take this key and turn it clockwise. I said clockwise, idiot. Yeah, like that. I'll hold him off and for the now. Beefcake. You got a hell of an arsenal there, lady. What are you planning? Here we go. Riding my well, this seems sort of like a fair now. fight. Take that. Eat shit and die. Yeah, don't help her. Just stand there like an idiot. Where'd you get that thing? No Give it to me. You hang on to that key. I got oh, this. I have to hold the key. That's normal. Uh-oh. Holy shit! Oh no. There's like a 98% chance she's gonna come back later on and like save my ass again. Like she's gonna have killed that thing and, and like... There's no way they would waste a character like that. Oh cool, now I'm gonna get cut in half in an elevator. Everyone's worst nightmare and I get to live it. <laughs> Real quick, let's start smoking. We almost died like seven times. What a goddamn clusterfuck. I do still have my axe. <sighs> do, 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 do. Oh, good old drawer snooping to get things that I don't know what they are. Welcome to the Vavilov Complex, named after the great. We need to find a way to open this armored door. 
Gee, you think? Enough with the lame advice, will you? Oh, is there stuff to pick up on all this? Because I haven't How been. They track I did not. Anyway. I did the not do that. betrayal was discovered by Mikhail Stockhausen. He was then arrested by the Argentum unit. So how did he end up here? After the trial, Petrov was sentenced to community service and sent back here as a prisoner. What? They couldn't find anyone else in the whole Soviet Union to do his job? Collective's launch was only a few months away. Replacing the lead engineer would have been foolish. Petrov had to finish what he'd started, and that's what they made him do. What's so special about the guy? Victor Petrov well. was previously the lead engineer of a secret department within the Academy of the Half-Life reference that we're going to get? Dedicated to programming robots for Collective 2.0. Right. Press G. Oh, I pressed D twice. That's smart. Well, that probably said something. Almost, almost through with this hour here anyways. I might go a little longer because I fucked up everything in the beginning. What the hell is happening here? Nothing. Why am I still going this way? What? Okay, that was a waste of time. I gotta... Oh, the valve was for this. I guess that guy was supposed to have spoken to me before, maybe. Oh! I'll be okay. <laughs> he made like a little like boom sound when he got pulled through the hole. Oh yeah, I can still do this. Ooh, it's very matrixy. So what it like just random pieces of metal plopped out of the wall and started killing people. Somebody's not having a good day. Safe areas. So there's auto saves and manual saves. Saving data. That's interesting. Whoa. All right. Can I watch uh, cartoons? That sounds fun. Okay, that was not as fun as I thought it would be. Let's go kill some shit. Oh, you're dead. Machines rose. Forewarned is forearm forearmed. Forewarned is forearmed. Okay. Ashes. May I give you some advice? I'm kind of busy right now. Try to avoid the robots' more powerful attacks. They're all powerful. Attacks performed by a robot. Oh, this one uh, doesn't suck as much as the rest. And they knock you down. Uh, at this rate, I won't last long. That oh, I probably wasn't supposed to do ass. that. Destroyed robots contain a neuropolymer resuscitation drug called Neuromed. Extra. Hold F in their direction. The Neuromed capsule and <laughs> use it to heal yourself. <laughs> I hold F in your direction. Give me your shit. It wouldn't hurt to collect other resources you find along the way, Major. May I remind you that your gear includes a special Yarov Abalakov backpack for storing items and equipment? It utilizes a quantum singularity to shrink items placed within it, then restores them to their original size upon extraction. Yeah, weird science, huh? It's like we're living in sci-fi times or something. Why'd you turn that thing on, huh? We were ordered to turn it on when you got here, comrade Muravyova. What is this? My order... Oh, there's emails too. Sweet Jesus, this game's gonna take three thousand years. <laughs> I could, I read. That's why I, I played the day like every day at sex game, obviously, and the like longest part of the game is just reading the emails. But I'm not gonna do all that right now because I'm supposed to be uh, getting somewhere on the stream. Can I get out? Get out of here. Off. To document everything and you can document your own art if you want to, but you're not recording this. Let me through. And don't go. Well, that's not fun. You seem to like you, shoot across the room. Uh, that's half the reason that you to have it. Uh, Granny Zena? Not without authorization. Oh, Granny Zena. Really? I was always allowed in here before, and now I'm not. <laughs> Listen here. Either you let me through right this instant, or I'll come back later. And somebody else will be calling his... Sneak up on the robot and perform a stealth attack. I'll use the opportunity to permanently disable it. Heels in here. What you say? 
Go ahead. Oh, you put it, you put it in the butt, and then you got. Oh, okay. I didn't know that I had to press that that many times. Hey, I wasn't ready. <laughs> I was against the wall. What the hell? <laughs> Jesus. Okay. Don't fuck everything up and die. That's uh, step one. How much health can I restore? Oh, I see I have two. It's kind of weird that you swing the, uh, the axe with one hand. Oops, I did not mean to decapitate that man. His, he was dead. He was dead anyways. Hey, is that a pair? Is it working? All pairs at facility 3826 are connected to emergency power and are never turned off. This allows employees to remain in constant contact. But I need, like, a password or an access level or something to get into a pair, right? I can provide you with access to any facility device. This also applies to the chirpers you will surely oh, encounter while en route to your mission objective. Got it. Yeah, I, I, I saw that, but... I'm also not paying enough attention. Oh, what the hell am I doing climbing that? Hey, glove. My name is Charles, comrade major. Whatever. Hey, oh, how did I miss all that? I managed to hack collective. The trader wasn't working alone. He was conspiring with several others. Several, huh? So where are they? They have already been eliminated. But it will be I missed so many things in this room. Okay, let's just grab That's this. That's why you're here. I think I'm just not holding F long enough. Alright, oh. Is there a lockpicking minigame? Am I doing something? Oh, okay. I have to... It's like, uh... It's like Skyrim. You gotta just... You gotta wiggle, wiggle your wires around a little bit. And then... And then push it. Okay, somewhere in here. There we go. Let's see if there's a monster I can sneak up on. Nope. I would like to see what happens in that process. Oh shit! Once again, I'm gonna keep pressing jump. So you're telling me a handful of traders managed to hack into Collective, a network created by the best minds in the Soviet Union? Technically speaking, Collective has not been hacked. No one could possibly circumvent the algorithms created by Professor Lebedev's team at the Academy of Consequences. Then why is all this crazy shit going down? The traders introduced a false combat mode. I wish this was a little faster at that causes the central sucking the uh, all humans as invading soldiers. And our scientists really can't fix it without the trouble. They can, not out of here. but it will take some time during which many more people will die and information about the incident will make its way outside the facility. So I missed something in there and I, I don't, I don't know. It's not worth my effort here. Let's see, okay, not sneaking up on that. Again, I jumped. <laughs> That's what I get for playing uh, so much Warhammer 40,000 Dark Tide. I'd like to have a, a gun, though. I definitely dodged that. Let's see. Oh, shit. I'm running out of time. I've made it so very little Damn into it. this Why game. Is everything locked here? Emergency mode was activated as soon as the robots began attacking humans. Facility 3826 is on lockdown. That includes the inner sector. So how am I supposed to open? I cut myself wrong. off. Oh shit!
Why is the animation frame rate on that not like fast? It, it looks it looks like it's animated at like 15 frames per second for some reason. Come on, get up, soldier. <sighs> Great. Just You're not move. granny. You okay? I'm fine. How many fingers? Uh, four. Great. Now get up. Oh, I, I thought I was going to get to answer that. <sighs> Who are they? They brought you here. Put pressure on this wound. They tried to save you. And who are you? Doctor. You got a name? No time for small talk. God damn. What? Forceps. Forceps, forceps, forceps. I'm on it. Get me them. What's this doing here? What's your name? No time what for small talk. You keep so long. You got a neuropolymer capsule. You don't need one. Yeah. So what's your name, Doc? Larissa, and you ask a lot of questions. You know what? You're on your own. You got this. Where are you going? It's useless. We don't have the equipment. I've got the equipment. Great. Now we're getting How somewhere. How did you do that? You ask a lot of questions. This dialogue is just flying. Get out. Jesus Christ, he's got a face laser. Oh, he's dead. Probably. You never want to deal with face laser. Holy shit. Avoid the beam. <laughs> no shit. What am I supposed to do? Oh, it's a boss fight. Whoop. Whoop. Oh, he's beating the shit out of me. He's trying to heal drop on me. Ow. They're not messing around with this melee combat. Terminated. Charles, where does the shaft Larissa crawled into go? It's hard to say. The ventilation system contains a large number of branching ducts. Fine. I can deal with oh, it later. Lighter. Can't go back in there. What? I don't know. I don't know. Oh, oh shit. 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 <laughs> I, I, I. There we go. That was uh, confusing. Is there a shotgun? <laughs> Oh shit, I have a shotgun. <laughs> well, okay. Who needs a shotgun when you got an axe? Let's just use that. I'm, I'm going full axe run for this hour. Uh, you can just open the doors. A little creepy. A lullaby? I don't like this. Charles. What's on the other side of the door? That's Nora's voice. She's very dangerous. Why is that? What the fuck? Oh. me! Oh, what a stun! I can't get enough jumps. Let me tie you to the dead, baby. No need to fight back. This is, this is great. Don't let her bind your arms. Can't you see I'm trying? Open to suggestions. Bring me to her sensor manipulator. Quick. How titillating. Rebellious Being dog killed by a refrigerator. Really turn me on. Oh, I'll turn you on. A horny right. refrigerator at that. What a brute. Oh, I love tough guys. I'm on fire. Closer. I can't reach her. I'm trying. I'm trying. She's one strong ass bitch. I'm at your service, sugar. Anything for my master. What is inside of this? I guess we're gonna find out. <laughs> More skills will become available to you soon. But choose shock. You were fortunate enough to acquire about 50 grams of neuropolymer. I suggest exchanging this dose with lovely Nora for a new skill. You don't mind, do you? This is very, like, they're just, like, borrowed everything from Bioshock. Oh, how can I resist? 
Now let me show you what I can do. Oh, I can upgrade my axe. Professionally, uh, I mean. Uh, I've seen it. More shit Literally. on the axe. Crispy critters. I am here to help you upgrade your red hot pocket rockets. And believe me, handsome, you can upgrade whatever tickles your fancy. Weapons are useful. Open the corresponding window, Major. Get rid of that glove, handsome. You don't need him anymore now that you've got me. I'll service you however you want, but I can do so much more. So my axe oh, has a scythe on it now. Things to come, you handsome. <sighs> Whoa! <laughs> okay, that's weird in first person. Yeah. Cool. Use this powerful weapon to split the skulls of your enemies and bring me gifts so they can get down and dirty. I'll show you what real smut feels like. <laughs> Why should I bring you gifts? It's like being pampered. Because I'm staying here a little bit longer. Resources to break them down for and produce items. this awkward Luckily for experience. us, it's not very picky. Although, some upgrades may call for unique components. <sighs> I take it that the... Oh, I cut myself off again. Oh, F. Press F to do things. What's with the Vovas with black bodies, Nikolai? Regular VOV A6s follow my orders and are always polite. I'm not even, like, understanding like the things I'm picking up. I just picked up chemistry. Are, I picked up orders. all of chemistry that exists. I don't, I guess I don't go down there. Didn't even apologize. Or do I? They only respond to people with high social ratings or something? Great, no. the goddamn elevators are out. What am I supposed to do? Jump down? They have no power. If you reconnect the power, they'll start working again. So it looks like I need to find a circuit breaker. But where the hell is it? I could follow the wires, but they're all hidden inside the walls. Electrical emissions can be detected via scanner. Get back to me when you can. I'm a little freaked out about this. Oh. There's something. What's this? Oh, follow the wires. I get it. <clears throat> okay, where the hell, uh, how do we get over there? I don't, uh, this is not the right way, but, oh, But shit. take care. There's a dandelion security camera up ahead. If it detects us, this place will be swarming with Got robots. Got the pokey axe. Take it easy. I can always distract it by throwing something, then knock it out with an EMP. The hell can I throw? I guess I can do that at the same time, too. <laughs> Someone in the shower? No. <laughs> it's not a shower, and, uh, yeah, no one's in there. It is a shower! It's a shitter shower! It's exactly what we need in, in society. How many people are, uh, shitting and showering at the same time? Pick up an item with F. Pick up what item? Oh, there we go. Okay. Comrade Major, you uh, said you knew how to avoid the camera. It's not. I it's not through. Did I not press F hard enough? Such as yourself. There we Sometimes go. you just need to go in guns blazing. This was one of those times. It was not one of those times. I just don't know what the hell I'm doing. <laughs> oh no! I'm not dodging again. I'm stuck on the wall. Oh no! Okay. Well, that wasn't. That was a bad. Uh, choice. I wanted to... Well, now I can do it right. Jumping, not working. Dodging, probably the best choice. Okay, let's try to actually throw this thing now. Throw. Okay. What the hell? I thought I was supposed to break it. Let's try again. There we go. Now, we sneak up on them some bitches and uh, do the old uh, wires in the butt. Also, let's just grab that real quick. Where are they?
Oh yeah, I can do this, I forgot. Whoop! Oh, I'm scanning them. Oh shit. <laughs> of course there's another camera. I want to do something okay, that sucked. I don't think this is really doing what I think it's supposed to do. It's just making me more vulnerable to getting kicked in the back. Do I have? A, did I unlock an electroshock ability? I don't. I'm not paying any attention. <laughs> I fucked up that somehow. <laughs> Oops. Oh, well. Okay. Is it going to come back up or... Okay, I'll just... I'll just move on. I'll just go ahead and hit that thing. Since I can't seem to use my abilities in the, in the right way. I only use them in the wrong way. It's way better. Hey, Chuck. Charless. Whatever. What'll happen if word gets out about this? The Soviet Union's reputation will suffer. Soviet robots are considered to be perfectly safe and reliable all over the world. They are? Of course they are. That's why Petrov's treason struck at the very heart of the motherland. He quite literally stabbed his own country in the back. He wants the entire world to stop using our robots. That son of a bitch. That son of a bitch. That's it. If I ever get a voice acting gig in my life, I hope that it's just that son of a bitch. Like, I want that to be... I, I, I want that line in my life. I wish these things would just shoot out their parts more effectively. That would be nice. Well, I think in the future, when I'm not streaming this, I'll play the... Or I'll read these with... Oh, look at that. I'll read them and actually understand what I'm reading. Since I'm not even reading the tooltips that tell me I have special abilities, like shooting lightning out of my, my hand whenever I want to. Why did I come in here? Oh yeah, the elevator. Which is not even... It's still incredibly far away. I think I, I just have to go find it. What if that guy's still alive? Maybe he fell in the fire and died. See that guy breakdancing back there? Aha! You found the key. Did I? We can access the circuit breaker. Oh, I did. Yep. The but I'm just gonna have a look around first. I need some parts to upgrade my weapon. I won't get far with this pile of shit. I wouldn't dream of stopping you. Smart move, Charles. Smart move. This feels faster, maybe. Maybe not. Maybe it's not at all. Okay. I don't know what I'm doing. Clearly they knew that looting was not going to be fast enough, so they put a, like this way to do it faster, and it's, it's still kind of shitty. Because, see, I missed something in here. What did I miss? Synthetic material. And once again, I'm climbing... <laughs> <laughs> I want to just sprint, and I'm like, uh, wait, let me start climbing something. Okay, let's let's uh, let's just drop down. Maybe that guy is down here. He's not. I don't know where he is. Oh, I needed it for this, and I didn't even hey, know it. Let's put a cookie in there. Yeah, even locks like cookies, right? Charles? Yes? Do you like cookies? Uh -huh. Charles is a glove. It looks... is it alive? Mm. 
Congratulations on your promotion. I keep feeling like I'm going to find a code in these. This is a passive security system with a laser relay. I've seen stuff like this plenty of times. Oh. You need a color code. Unfortunately, we don't have any codes. You'll have to try to decipher it using logic. Seriously? Yeah, like I think I that would have been better to just... Off on its own. Like instantly let you slurp out all the stuff in a container what the fuck does this mean okay i'll just figure it out on the fly i don't know what the fuck that was uh whoop I'm guessing these all need to be white. Oops. Try to match Oops. the colors of the laser beams oh, with the colors oh, of the Oh no, lights. they don't. They need to be the that colors. Okay. Well, thanks. If I would have paid attention, I would have known that. So, how the hell do you get How do you get that to happen? I need to get white at the bottom, so just push the whites Wait, this is the thing that needs to be... Okay, now I get it. What the hell do these yeah, things even do? <laughs> What's the What's point of that? these? At all. It was some tomfoolery. Alright. Oh, that was fun. Now we can go on the elevators. We've aligned the lasers. Every elevator well, has a, you which know, one? laser I system. I suggest the one on the right. In other words, you don't actually know. In that case, I'm taking the one on the left. I didn't even know there was one on the right. But I'm going to listen to myself. I've marked another waypoint for ease of navigation. How dense do you think I am? I know where I need to go to complete my mission. I was only trying to make things easier for you. You can make things easier by getting off my grill. Okay, can I... Is there like a save point somewhere that I can go if to? If you recall, the door is electromagnetically locked. Are you freaking deaf or something? Pardon me, please continue. Saw that coming. I don't think I hit anything with this. Oh, that time I did. There you go. Look at that. I'm a regular axe maniac. <clears throat> okay, we're. I keep feeling like this is a uh, sprint, but it doesn't actually... Well, does it make you sprint? No, just gives you that boost. It does nothing but the boost. A shiny sign. Shiny should be easy to spot. Let's just go here before they... There's, uh, there's bad guys in there. Come back, shot. Now they tell me about it. Oh, there's three. Oh, good job. I missed entirely. And then jumped. <laughs> Let me just heal up real quick. Come to the big room. Okay, I'm gonna use the shotgun now because I'm, I'm tired of fighting these these guys. Wow, this is so much easier. That's ridiculous. I'm assuming it's it's because you know ammo is limited. But My dearest V, Jesus, it's too dangerous to keep leaving messages like this. This is the last one. Get ready. I can I'm fight one guy with together, this. And then I'll be right behind you. We're going to get out of this nightmare. Yours always, 
Well, I didn't do shit. He was just like, huh? You shocked me? Oh, well. It's pretty rewarding melee combat, though. I gotta say. I gotta stop pressing shift because it's make it's still what makes me jump up like an idiot on top of every shelf that I get near. Big white boxes. This feels like a hallway with significance, and I want to go back. Oh, I, can I not go back? Oh, yeah, I can. Is there an indicator for when this is charged? I think I bur I think this is not going to let me back through now. And the indicator is down at the bottom. But still. Well, so much for that. Whatever was back there, I don't get to get anymore. It's probably all the stuff I ever wanted. That's usually how it goes. There's no other way forward. We have to take it. Take it where? Petrov escaped while working in Babalov's cold workshop. It would be logical to begin our search there. So, how do I get there? First, we need to get to the distribution center. This cable car will take us there. What, the one that looks like it's gonna kill me? So disappointing. This is the part from the trailer that came out like two years ago. Polymer. I've done it before. It's nice, actually. Kind of like swimming with whales and dolphins in the ocean. It's so peaceful. Oh, yep, yeah, that was. <laughs> didn't notice that one. Now I gotta heal. I don't have air because I feel like I'd be drowning by now. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> that was a little too, like, realistic. How am I supposed to restart the line? There should be a control panel nearby. <laughs> you don't say. Nothing like going through some hallway tubes. Wait, wasn't it just here? There's the control panel. And of course it's locked. You guys just love these things, don't you? But this is a new one. A combination lock. Ooh. Uh, it'd take me a year to guess the combo. Look around. Maybe someone has the code. This is zero four five one, like that guy said in the beginning. The schematic. Need to find the schematic. Oop, oop. I didn't. I didn't mean to press that. Uh, what was that? We're now witnessing a glorious. Something's got to move. Anything. Who's talking? Is it my glove? Oh, it's that. No schematic. No go. Fuck me. He's alive. Schematic. Need a schematic. Unfortunately, he's dead. We are surrounded by corpses. Why have you frozen? It's just like everything here. They won't go. Nope. Won't go without the schematic. The dead have a residual neural polymer memory and are capable of communicating for some time after death. We'll be able to couple with one another to produce a full-blown airborne city with residential, industrial... The schematic, the one I need to move the cars. Where is it? The station master has it. 
didn't make it. Wasn't as fast as me. He died. Everybody here is as dead as fuck. Did the station master die in this tunnel? This tunnel. He died. And everything froze. Right in front of my eyes. You need the schematic. Capital of our Soviet Union, which will soar above us all in just ten years. Are you sure the station master has it? He carries it with him. The station master. Got it. I'll look for it. All right. Looking Maybe for a I dead guy. Said thank you. Why is this Holy cup floating? Holy shit, a talking corpse. What did you oh, say, comrade major? Oh, you know, anymore. I fought in the whole war from beginning to end. I've seen some shit. But talking right. corpses, that's a new one. How We're the fuck is this even for possible? A station. It's a byproduct oh, looking of for lingering a station neuropolymer memory activity. Everyone killed here was polymerized. Their brains haven't decomposed yet. So they I guess I should connected. follow the icon the that's telling me where to go, but I was just wondering what was up there. Can I get in this? Is that it? What the, can I get it? Or did I just look at it? I have to memorize it? <laughs> can I not pick it up? Just, okay, so uh, it's 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 that. It's something like that. I guess. Charles, so this isn't a dead person talking to me. It's the neuropolymer in his noggin, right? Crudely speaking, yes. As it fades away, neuropolymer memory temporarily stores the individual's last thoughts. Creepy. How long the shiny sign by the man I on display? Did exactly. I miss that? Somewhere between a minute and a couple of days. But it seems the more time passes out, that not the more bad, corrupt the information becomes. I see. So the stuff they're saying isn't always that important. Poor bastards. Oh, that's that's what you mean by shiny. <laughs> that's. I was like, what the fuck is that weird little, you know, thing going on there? Chicken shells. Oh, cool. These creepy robots. So, what will it be, Major? Weapons or ability? So they're not all going to try to kill me before I get to, uh, do this? Need a recipe for this electro. Oh god, there's a whole this is a whole thing, isn't it? <laughs> do, 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 do. What the hell? I don't have anything. Let's Can I upgrade this even more? Powerful chopping blow. Wait, that's what I had before, isn't it? Cartridge gun. So my axe can shoot. Takes uh, 18 T's, uh, 12 uh, cylinders, and three other cylinders. Oh, I can't be knocked down when I do that? I didn't notice. Interesting. I can I could well let's see what else I got. Let's see what my shotgun can do. Muzzle break, damage, recoil, cartridge slot, more rounds. And oh wait, is that more rounds or I don't know. And mechanical aiming devices. Oh, it's already there. So, yeah, let's do that. I'm sure this will come in handy for like a boss fight. I 
thin layer of special chemical polymer to the bullet as it passes through the barrel, giving it additional properties when it comes in contact with the enemy. So it hurts? No, I don't know. <laughs> I still know what that means. It doesn't. It doesn't say it gives it more damage, but the description is saying it does something related to the shot. But it gives you a cartridge slot, so I guess that means you can load special ammo or something. I'm gonna do the axe if I still can. Oh, it's the same thing. Let's do it anyways. Oh shit, there's other stuff here I didn't even notice. I don't have any recipes, so it doesn't really matter. So, what will it be, Major? Weapons? Oh, I can make my gloves stronger, too. Oh, that's an entirely different thing. Wow, there's a lot of things in here. Let's see, frostbite. I'm assuming freezes things. Mass telekinesis. I don't have it. Oh, elemental damage. That sounds good. Spray targets and services with a jet of combat polymer that can be set on fire. Or electrified or frozen. Squirt some people and then uh, hurt some people. Squirt some people and hurt some people. That sounds great. <laughs> that that alone is a reason for me to get this. And a shield. Surround you with a shield. Protects you from melee and range and redirects part of the blah blah blah. Does not protect against critical attacks. Energy management. I get that. Guess not. Or I guess I already have it. Uh, I still have some polymer here, though. Let's see what we can do. Should I get... Uh, should I... Let's do increased shock power. I guess I won't be able to use it. So no, I'm not sure. How do I uh, get rid of that? Oh, I didn't want to switch. Oh, there we go. I can watch a cartoon? Well, this is fun. Beset on all sides, lost in the dark. Fry your foes in a shower of sparks. That was beautiful. So what have I done here? Did I uh, mess this up and I can't use it until I get more energy? No! Huh. That's... There's that. Oh, don't touch it. Access granted. 